Police say they know the guy they're looking for who punched a conservative activist on the UC Berkeley campus. Police not revealing a name yet, but say the suspect is not a student or an affiliate of the university. The attack just the latest in a series of violent encounters aimed at young conservatives like those at Turning Point USA. You know what's better for people? Cheap labor, that's how you get cheap. You pay nothing. Don't like film it, bro, film yeah, it. I'm filming it. Yeah, bro. Take responsibility for your all right, here we act as founder and president of Turning Point USA, Charlie Kirk. Charlie, thanks for being here. Thanks for getting up so early. And it seems to me that the left only allows you to have free speech if you agree with said free speech. That's exactly right. I commonly say the left hates the idea that there are other ideas. And this is getting very serious. I mean, look, all violence should be be denounced by everyone. But in a week where there was a lot of coverage about a fake hate crime in Chicago. There was a real hate crime out at University of California, Berkeley, and you saw that horrendous footage where um, there was a conservative activist at our Turning Point USA recruiting event where they were just talking to students, trying to grow our chapter at University of California, Berkeley. And our students know we're going to be in the ideological minority at UC Berkeley. We understand it's not exactly the easiest place for conservatives, but no, no, nonetheless, we sh we're there and we're recruiting. And someone found our message it's so disturbing that they had to challenge us physically and violently. And thankfully, the police got involved. Mm -hmm. They found this individual. But this is a growing trend. And you saw in those videos, this is happening hundreds of times a year, not necessarily always physically, but we get we get verbal abuse, the harassment, and also just the retaliation right. from the leftist uh, uh, people on campus that try to prevent us from being there in the first but place. But Charlie, this isn't just happening on college campuses. You, of course, were confronted uh, with Candace Owens in Philadelphia last year. Let's take a listen to that and then talk about it. So, Charlie, those were violent Antifa protesters running you guys out of a cafe. Is this getting worse when it comes to college campuses and just conservatives in general being able to just go about their daily lives in America and have their own belief system? Yeah, I'm afraid that um, un unless the left gets called out for this ridiculous behavior, it is getting worse. And so what's so scary about this example at University of California, Berkeley, is that a staff member for the university praised this attack. Mm -hmm. came out and tweeted and said, not a professor, but a staff member for the, the data education program said, thank you for coming out and challenging Turning Point USA. I mean, are, are, this is really where we're getting, where physical violence is now being heralded by official staff members of the university. And so, look, the left, they hate the idea that there are other ideas. We are not going to back down. We don't ever engage in any sort of physical confrontation. But we're also not going to allow the leftist mob to get away with using physical intimidation against conservative students. And, look, we have so many people out there that just want to be able to grow chapters right. around the ideas of free markets and limited government without having debate. to get punched in the face. <laughs> a real debate. That's exactly rather. Right. Than any vis That's physical right. confrontation. Here's what Berkeley had to say. That's you see Berkeley's commitment to freedom of expression and perspective is unwavering, as is its intolerance for violence and harassment. Uh, how's, what's your response to that statement? Well, um, they're saying the right thing, but now they need to be doing the right thing. Are they really teaching um, tolerance of other people's views? And I always like to say the most intolerant people in the world that you're going to find are liberals preaching tolerance. Right. And, yeah. um, and, and we see that time and time again where you know, they're very tolerant of things on the left, but when a conservative comes on campus, not so much. And uh, we'll see. I might be visiting there next week. I might be making some news right now. So I might be going to see how tolerant uh, UC Berkeley actually is. Okay. Um, be and safe. Uh, we'll be yeah. challenging on their home turf. Charlie you better Kirk, believe it. Thank so. you for all you do. Keep up the good work. Thanks, Charlie. And be safe. Thanks, Katie. You bet. Thank you. All right. Well, three top.